very fast. So in this change ecosystem of Indian healthcare, it is extremely important for all of us to understand how the journey is going. Whilst in the last couple of years, we have seen inflations. And inflations to that extent that there are scenarios where common people at times are not very clear as to run, how to run the family in terms of their educational costs, in terms of their healthcare costs, and similar. Whilst the story is not only about you and me, it is about the common people at mass. So there is where Dawa India is bringing a sea change in the Indian healthcare ecosystem by offering high quality medicines at a very affordable price. It is so much important that people who have aged parents, who have ailments and many more, they do ensure that the medicine bills are optimized at their home. Each one of you who are there and who have people in their home, who have their families in their home, who are, have diseases of either chronic, gastro, pains, speeds, nephro, or anything similar, they understand that what could be the kind of cost of medicines that actually goes through. At times, it is really pain. And at times, I have seen that in the rural villages, people cannot even consume medicines morning, afternoon, evening. And there is a terrible pain because the cost of medicines are high. The two critical factors and parameters always drive. One is, we have to ensure that the last mile consumer or patient gets high quality medicines. Along with high quality medicines, it is critical and important that the end patient gets medicine which is comfortable for their pockets and which is cost friendly. When both these two combines together, then it becomes a revolution and that is where Dawa India plays a critical role to build and bring this revolution for the country. Change is difficult. However, change is required. Change of mindset to ensure that the end consumer consumes branded, unbranded, generic medicines have to go on to a conversion that the end consumer can consume high quality generic medicines only. There are countries like US, UK, Europe who have shown the pathway that high quality generic medicines are the way. And the end consumer stroke patient have the right to choose which medicine they are taking based on the desired molecules that has been recommended by the physician or the clinician. And there is where the revolution is coming in India. And this revolution will not only drive a better healthcare ecosystem in India, but this revolution will ensure that India becomes much more healthy. India can afford medicines and India becomes an ecosystem like what we see abroad and many more. With that, I keep my content of discussion as our internal cost structures are very low. And since our internal cost structures are low and we optimize, so what it means is that at a company level, our profitability decreases. So meaning which, if a branded medicine costs, say for example, 1000 rupees, the Dawa India generic medicine would be way lower in terms of cost of that. And at the end of the day, it benefits the end consumer or patient. If you are a consumer, it would definitely benefit you and, and, and you become healthy much faster with a lower cost outflow. So how do we sustain is that we manage our internal ecosystem, uh, our supply chain management, our information technology, our people costs, our infrastructure costs, and our profitabilities, which are well managed and there is a very thin line of profitabilities that we maintain. So that's the answer for your first question. Your second question is that, at times you feel that the, the prices of medicines, I, I assume you're talking of branded medicines, that's my assumption, are very high. That's what you said. So there is where the generic medicine comes in picture. And that is what I said in the, in the opening statement. That why do you think that it is important 
for this kind of session because media and press are the biggest power and tool for any country whether it's developed country developing country for any kind of news and information and right media right press can change the ecosystem of the country it is time that all of us get into that driver of change and you will not understand that pain unless you have your parents your children who cannot afford the day you understand that your parents are part of this ecosystem who cannot afford you go to the end village who do not have money even to eat food from where do they get money to buy medicines and there is where my appeal to media is that you play a critical role to build the ecosystem of change as a driver because at times you may not understand the pain that the last my villager actually undergoes i have worked in the last my villages to see what kind of tears rolls out when the costs are high many of you will echo with me some of you would agree if you have seen those kind of people so there is where the generic medicine comes into place but it should be of a desired quality it should of be of good quality and there is where the oil india plays a massive critical role where we are changing the face of the healthcare ecosystem the way medicines are consumed and there is where it is important that the end consumer or patient understands the power of good quality generic medicines next question please this question in two different parts there are certain elements where you need multiple medicines to get cured so that there is no two ways about it but there there could be a possibility where there could be a reduction of medicine that could be given now why you are given 10 different kind of medicines that only whosoever is giving or the physician or the clinician can answer but what have to be consumed based on the right clinical practice is what is important for example if someone is unwell but someone is weak someone has having a dysentery there are three different kind of medication molecules that may have to be given for the need of the body i think the answer is is much deeper the answer is that is there a possibility to have less medicine consumption in india probably you are trying to ask that and more from antibiotic kind of scenario now if you see anyone who is unwell or anyone who is having a throat problem usually take antibiotics i'm not i'm, I'm trying to be careful in using the brand names now there are scenarios where it could be relieved at a lesser medicine also however it all depends on the physician or the clinician who who is recommending to you so it 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 is not a direct question for generic medicines but it is it is more of a questions for the physician who is recommending you the various kinds of medicines there are good physicians also who recommends less medicine so it, it all depends on that physician it is a very very critical role for this kind of distribution when you operate at a b c cat kind of locations as of now we have a central distribution network that operates and the central distribution network operates on an ai tool based on the rol the reorder levels so for example what happens and our, our primary customers are definitely chronic so when it's a chronic kind of patient usually you will understand that there are well planned medication that goes through for example if someone takes a cardiac medicine so then there is a well planned cardiac medication that goes through every month so in that way what happens is that at a central distribution management and at a store level when the rol drops for example if if the transit time is x days assuming that if if the store is somewhere in eastern eastern part of the country and the transit time from the distribution channel is 10 days then there is a reorder level will maintained on that and based on that reorder level the movement happens we keep our cost structures as lean as possible but with the kind of scale up that we are growing we will have zonal distribution also that will reduce the pace and movement of the materials that goes through thank you